first thing, always focusing on the client and not on yourself. Marketers are always talking about them and these, and it's always them, it's not, not us. Communication culture tends to be more us, protecting us from them. Marketers are more focused on the them, although that's changing as well, including in communications, by the way. Um, not bureaucratic. That's easy for me to say, particularly what's, what's going on now, but people who work in marketing tend to be not bureaucratic. Matter of fact, they hate bureaucracy, right? Right. Um, they rely heavily on marketing research. Focus on integrated programs rather than one little off things. I remember my staff at Health Canada, we used to have to keep telling people, we only do integrated programs. And everybody, oh, no, no, we want to do this little thing. Well, if you want to do this little thing, you're not going to be able to do it because I'm not going to let you do it because that's not the way to do marketing. So we, uh, we kind of had quite the hammer there. Bias towards segmentation. Segmentation is the key to marketing. There's no ifs, ands, and buts about it. And if you're a marketer and you're using the, those terrible, horrible, anti-marketing words, general public, you know you're in trouble. Those are two words. Um, by the way, some people, uh, when I had a marketing class, if any of my students used, uh, there were two terms that you weren't allowed to use in my class. The first one was general public. Those are two words that were forbidden in my class. God help anyone who ever said that. The other wa word was awareness. So those were the two words banned, and I didn't want, because I want people to get out of general public, which makes, who is the general public? Is my grandson who's two years old, is he the general public? Or my sister who's in her 70s, is she, like who is the general public? I never have any idea who we're talking about, so let's not talk about that. And of course that terrible word awareness, which is, the bane of marketers all over the world. And we also define co a competition broadly. And we don't just, we're not very narrow-minded, you know, more big picture. What else? We focus on branding and positioning. And I'm giving a round table this afternoon, I think it's this afternoon, on why branding is the most important element of marketing. 